Problems again today with debit card transactions at Meyer. This time, Meyer says the issue was quickly resolved. A far cry from problems last month that still has customers frustrated. News 8's Joe Lafergie is live in Walker with more on the challenge of getting answers. Joe? Yeah, see, well, Meyer says that uh, issue was quickly resolved. There are those customers out there that are hoping they don't see a repeat of an outage from May 21st. No debit card transactions. The sign went up this morning on doors of Meyer stores, including the Meyer owned Bridge Street Market in Grand Rapids. Within hours, the problem was resolved. A Meyer spokesman said the issue was with Chase Bank's debit card processing system. When it happened, we quickly switched to cash credit only at our stores. No pin slash debit to protect our customers. The issue has since been resolved by Chase and our stores returned to accepting all types of payments a while ago, according to a Meyer spokesman. Meyer's latest plastic problem come as customers are still trying to resolve issues that date back over two weeks. They couldn't take debit transactions, but they would run it through as a credit if your card allowed. And I know my card allows through my financial institution. But the credit option didn't work for Diane Stone, so she wrote a paper check. I have my, where it went through my account with the electronic check and then where it went through two other times on my debit account. The end result, Stones paid close to $1,000 for purchases that were supposed to add up to just over 300. 17 days later, she's been back and forth with Meyer, her bank, and then back to Meyer. The last contact I had with them, they were actually rude. And there's still no resolution. When I called them, they have more or less washed their hands of it. Not our problem. Very frustrating. Meyer is the ultimate party responsible. I don't know what the holdup is. After fielding multiple emails from customers with similar problems, we reached out to Meyer first yesterday, then again today. Our question is simple. What's the issue and what are you doing to resolve it? We're still hoping to hear back. Meantime, Meyer shoppers like Diane Stone are rethinking their shopping habits. I'd like to keep the business local with, with Meyer, but We'll see where this where this goes. And we'll keep pressing Meyer for answers. Live tonight in Walker, Joe Lafergie, News 8.